brought to you by Old Stuff Incorporated. You'll dig it. Did you know that almost all the things that have ever lived on Earth are gone? And it's not just that the living things are gone. The kinds of living things, the species are gone. And we figured this out when we found their fossils. Fossils from an old Latin word that means to dig. Dig? So, fossil this. Uh -huh. Have you ever seen a three-toed horse? Well. Or a camel in the middle of North America? Uh, or a, a rhinoceros in uh, Nebraska? Can't say I have. Take a look at this. That's a three-toed horse, and this is a rhino, and we're in Nebraska. Now, these are actually fossils of rhinos, and fossils are evidence of living things that have turned to stone. Fossils usually tell a story. The story here is 10 million years old. These animals all were breathing bad air, probably from a volcanic eruption hundreds of kilometers from here. They came here to get a drink and they died. And then volcanic ash was blown in by the wind and they were buried. And about 10 million years later, they're still here. This is something we don't get to see very often. The fossil skeleton bones are all held in their original position. So here we have a snapshot, a three-dimensional picture of the past. Now here's the thing. There's no rhinoceros quite like this one anywhere in the world today. And there are no rhinoceroses at all anywhere around here. Things on the earth have changed. Different kinds of living things have come and gone. Some of them are extinct. In fact, 90% of all the living things that have ever been on earth are gone. They're extinct. And we figured it out from fossils.